Hello friends, uh, you are seeing the question on your screen. This is also a previous year CSIR question asked for two marks. Okay, and the question says which peptide bond marked as A this A B C D E will be broken when the following peptide is treated with enzyme trypsin at pH 7. So trypsin cleaves arginine and lysine at C terminal. This we have to remember. And if the arginine or uh, lysine has proline next to it, then it will not target that peptide bond. It will not leave that peptide bond. Now let us analyze. First, let us scan for lysine. And another one thing, remember, pep this trypsine is an endopeptidase. When I say endopeptidase, it, it means that Whenever endopeptidase acts, it will never produce a monomer, a single free amino acid. It should always produce a dipeptide because it has to act in between, in between the proteins or the peptide sequence. Now, and it should never act at the ends, not at the ends, like for example here. It cannot act over here or here oh, let's see that in more detail now this is being treated with trypsin so we know that trypsin cleaves arginine and lysine at C terminal so you might expect that it will cleave over this region a bond but no it won't because this is present at the end and uh, trypsin is an endopeptidase not exopeptidase uh, and next is you might assume that it will cleave over here but no even that is wrong because arginine is followed by proline and whenever this arginine or lysine is followed by proline that peptide bond cannot be cleaved by this trypsin now again yes this peptide bond will be cleaved by trypsin D because it's not followed by proline and it is present in the endo region in between the sequence and it is not producing any monomer now one might assume that even this sequence this e bond can also be cleaved by the trypsin but no it cannot be cleaved why because if this bond is cleaved there will be a free glycine monomer and this is endopeptidases not exopeptidases endopeptidases should cleave in between and produce minimum two sequence of dipeptide it cannot produce a monopeptide it's not an exopeptidase it's an endopeptidase so even this option is wrong the only right option is d so i hope you found this tutorial interesting and informative so Keep watching for more and subscribe, like and comment. Thank you. Have a nice day.